Welcome back to Living 808. Earlier this year in May, we told you about a cosmetic dentist in Hawaii who is known around the world for his amazing smile transformations, who was giving away a smile makeover to celebrate his 30th anniversary of dentistry in Hawaii. Now that dentist held a contest and chose a winner, and we surprised the winner live on Living 808. Today we've got the big reveal. Joining me in studio, Dr. Wynn Okuda and the winner of Dr. Okuda's Smile Makeover Giveaway, Nadine Choi Fu. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Welcome back. Thank, thank, you, thank you. you. Okay. Wow. You <laughs> look amazing. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Really, it's it's so beautiful. Um, thank you. Tell me, how do you feel? <sighs> Phenomenal. <laughs> You can tell it kind of exudes, you know, your smile's even bigger than, you know, the last time we saw each other. Um, I feel like amazing. a new woman. Terrific. <laughs> you look like a new woman. Um, <laughs> tell us real quick, you know, what has the reaction been from family and friends? Stunned. Um, <laughs> they step back. They're like, wow. Like they can't believe. And the process time, they're just, they're blown away by how quickly it was and how beautiful it came out. And yeah. I do want to talk to Dr. Okuda in a yes. bit about the whole process, but um, what was the experience like for you? You know, kind of, I heard you were pampered. It was five <laughs> star. <laughs> Never been to a dentist that offers what uh, Dr. Okuda's office does. I mean, from beginning to end, it's phenomenal. It's comforting, it's, um, it's welcoming. He's just amazing. His team, his staff is just wonderful. Yeah. So um, full disclosure here, I am also a, <laughs> uh, what is it, client, patient, patient, patient mm -hmm. um, of Dr. Okuda. So I know exactly what you're talking about. I'm like, people usually dread going to the dentist, but I look forward to it. It's oh, like yeah. my mom time. I get to watch movies. You get massaged. <laughs> yes. So I know exactly what you're talking yes. about. Um, tell me what this was, this, this whole process was like for you well you know for Nadine because it's you know every smile makeover is different and but for Nadine there was a lot of missing teeth a lot of broken down teeth again it's just years of just not being able to get things done mm -hmm. because you know just really a person who's helping out the community but just but not able to help herself. Sure. And so that's why there was a lot of work that was needed it originally was going to start as a smile makeover but it ended up as a full mouth reconstruction. And part of the big reason for that is I just want to help her to become whole again. Mm -hmm. You know, because that's what really dentistry is about. It's not about just the beauty, but how, it, how we're able to balance that out with good health and function. Sure. And so that was important for me in this 30th year to be able to conjure my skills to be able to help her. <laughs> So how, maybe tell me, I mean, how do you think this is, is going to change your life or already has? Oh, it already has. Um, I feel normal. I can eat and function. Before there was so much dysfunction, discomfort, and now it's, it's amazing. Yeah. It really is. <laughs> That's wonderful. I mean, I can just see, you know, your whole kind of energy has changed too. Um, since you celebrated your 30th year in practice, yes. Dr. Okuda, um, what did this smile makeover mean for you? Well, you know, you've known me for a long time, Trini, yeah. and so it's been quite a journey, you know, just early beginnings and then being able to have people who just fly in to see me, you know, uh, and with all kinds of different patients from all over the world. And so it's been a real big journey, but for me, being a local guy, you know, McKinley High School, go Tigers, <laughs> you know, it was important to give back to local. And yeah. so that's why it was important for me to use my abilities and celebrate the 30th practice anniversary in my way, which is to be able to help out a local person who's been helping out our community. Sure. You know, that, you know, to, whether it's to pay it forward or whatever you want to call it, to me, you know, it's important that it defines me to be able to give back. Yeah, I, I mean, I know you, so I, you're good like that. Um, and you're much too humble to even say, I mean, you've got clients flying in from all over, I mean, movie stars, entertainers, um, you know, it's pretty impressive. Wow. So, you know, this is wonderful what you've done for Nadine, what you do for the community yourself. We've, we're almost out of time, but I just want to say you will be back with us, yes, right? Yes, right. And you're going to give us some, you know, some information. You're going to educate on, us. On innovations, you know, okay. in dentistry and cosmetic dentistry. So we can help educate your audience. So we'll be yeah. able to talk more in the story looks like. This is great. This is really life changing for a lot of people because, you know, you're out, you're greeting people, you're talking to people. Right. This is just, you know, everyday people. 
And, um, you know, if you're self-conscious about your smile, mm -hmm. whatever it may be, um, it can be fixed and, you know, it can change your life. So thank you so much for sharing yes. your story with thank us. Thank you for having me. And Dr. Okuda, <laughs> thank you for all that you do. Oh, it's my yes. pleasure. Thank really. you. We are going to have much more on Living 808 when we come back. Stay with us.